question I get quite a bit is, well, if um, how is it safe for a pregnant woman to be vaccinated if the vaccine is not approved in infants? And, and part of that is because we know that the vaccine itself, the, the components of the vaccine do not cross a placenta. What can cross a placenta um, are the antibodies themselves, which is great, right? Um, you know, provides that immunity to what degree we're not really sure, but um, uh, at least some recent studies are showing that um, infants born to, 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 to mothers who have been vaccinated um, have similar and uh, tighter levels compared uh, to the mothers. So, you know, that's, that's great news. Um, and more recently, right, we have more uh, safety data supporting the use of vaccines in pregnancy. Uh, we know that the few women that were uh, included in the vaccine trial sort of unexpectedly because they joined not knowing that they were pregnant. Um, we know that they had good outcomes um, at the end of the, the trials. And now over the past several months, we um, have a registry of pregnant women who have received, especially the mRNA vaccines, uh, with good outcomes. Uh, there have been no um, associations with uh, uh, with miscarriage, which was an early con a concern early on.